For one North Texas family, being educators is a long-running tradition. The family has four generations of school principals, including a current principal in the Richardson ISD. And with 80 years of working in Texas classrooms, this family has a unique perspective on what it takes to retain teachers as the state deals with a staffing shortage. Fox Wars' Lori Brown joins us live from Richardson. Lori. Clarice, as we sat down with three generations of educators today, it is clear that for them, education is not a job but a calling, one that they say our society needs to help foster or the shortage of teachers could get worse. Oh, yes. Ashley Baker, principal at Canyon Creek Elementary School, has followed in her mother's footsteps and her grandfather's and her great-grandfather's, who began his education career after serving in the Navy in World War II. His son, Aubrey, Judge Perry, a retired principal from Mesquite ISD, says some things about education never change. The kids can tell whether you like them or not. Amy Lewis knew she was destined for a career in education, watching her dad from a young age. Well, I played a lot with dolls and lots of books, lots, lots of reading. I always loved school, so. Um, and she was always the teacher, and Sheridan would say she always is the teacher. Yeah, I was always the teacher. I was always the coach, always the teacher, and she had my little sister had to be my student. And she was a little <laughs> bossy. <laughs> Leadership. <laughs> And Baker says getting to grow up watching her mom serve as principal at her school provided the best kind of preparation there is. She taught me how to be a servant leader, and I think that Granddaddy taught her that and myself. It's the kind of mentorship that Baker hopes state lawmakers will foster with legislation like HB 11. That bill would pay for school districts to offer more teacher residencies, and programs so that put now, future teachers in classrooms with mentor teachers for a year. Lewis says that type of program was always beneficial for her. I had the intern resident program and they would be there all year long. And so I got to watch them and I always ended up hiring one, two, mm -hmm. maybe three of them because I could watch them. What is it like to see your daughter and granddaughter in education? Well, I think the word would be proud, very proud of them and maybe I had a little influence. I'm super proud of Ashley every day and get emotional. Just I hear the stories and I'm so proud of how she handles things and she's just doing a great job. And Baker has two sons now watching her at Canyon Creek Elementary. Do you think you could be next in line? Uh, yeah. <laughs> think she's the best mom ever. Are you, are you gonna wanna take her job one day? Yeah. <laughs> are you gonna be a principal? Yeah, <laughs> but one day. Teacher salaries are often cited as a cause of the teacher shortage in Texas. This month, Richardson ISD called on lawmakers to increase the per student funding. It's something that has not been increased since 2019, despite 17% in inflation. Clarice. That is an inspiring family tradition. Lori, thank you for sharing that with us.